Okay, welcome back. Now, let's check on this. Cookie, cookie. See here, my okra flour sauce here is ready. It's cooked, it's ready. So, next thing I'm gonna do is, remember my fish and my shrimp? Yeah, I'm gonna put it in my pot now. I'm gonna put it in my pot of goodness. Just gonna put it in here, like that. You can pot boil your shrimp if you want. For me, it's just a personal thing. I just like to, you know, for my shrimp to be really, really attentive. I'm gonna empty my flour sauce in my pot here. Right on top. Mm -mm. Oh Lord, how mercy, how mercy. I'm gonna put a little bit of water in here and pour it in here. Got a little bit of water in here. Take all the goodness from in here. I don't want to leave anything in here. Okay. And I'm going to pour it in the pot. Alright. As you can see, my palawa sauce is ready. Let's move this around all around the thing that the reason why i like to put the shrimp in at last because the shrimp is very easy to cook it's not hard to cook my final bone but be careful with these bones now i'm going to put in my palm oil this is my palm oil This is gonna be about a cup of pine oil. Mm, it's not coming. It's gonna frozen. It's cold in Utah here, so everything freezes. Can you believe this? Can you believe this? That's so crazy. Yep. Just come closer so you can see. All these, all this goodness, all this yumminess. So in here, I have shrimp, fish, uh, 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 chicken feet, chicken, pig feet. And smoke and dry, smoke turkey and dry fish. That's what I have in here. Whoa, oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm gonna turn this stove back on and let this just boil for like five minutes and this will be ready. So keep watching. I will show you how when I'm eating. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And please guys, my go for me link is in my description box if you want to show your support i will appreciate it thank you thank you thank you thank you and i will see you in the next